A day away from Super Tuesday, where millions will cast their ballots in the presidential primary. As WBZ's Penny Commit shows us, election officials here say they're ready. Massachusetts is one of 15 states with voters heading to the polls tomorrow with 40 GOP delegates up for grabs. We're optimistic for a reasonably good turnout. With over 467,000 ballots already cast, about 90% of those by mail, the state is gearing up for a busy Super Tuesday. I surely think, particularly where many of the Trump supporters tend to not want to vote by mail, that we will surely exceed 400,000. Tomorrow. Secretary of the Commonwealth William Galvin says something different about this election cycle far more unaffiliated voters. We have, as I said, a significant opportunity for independent voters since they can take a ballot from either party without becoming a party member. That is very unusual. I don't know that it's unique, but it's unusual. Since the start of the year, Galvin says over 13,000 Democrats have unenrolled from their party allowing them to cast ballots as independents in tomorrow's primary election. Republican Party enrollment is also down by about 4%. But clearly, voters are preferring not to be affiliated with either party. With more independents heading to the polls, Galvin says his team has increased security measures significantly. A police officer is president present at every polling place. In addition to the Republican presidential primary, Galvin says six towns are holding municipal elections, along with a special election in Worcester County. The polls across the state open tomorrow morning at 7. They'll close at 8 in the evening. If you have a mail ballot, be sure it's dropped off by time the polls close or it will not be counted. Do not actually mail it in. In Boston, I'm Penny Commit, WBZ News.